You know, I always said, idiots are us, right? And I've always said, you know, I like being an idiot, you know, especially for you guys. But, you know, today is one special kind of idiot to find out and stick around. Welcome back to another video of the Vocek Experience, where idiots are always us. Right now, always me, and I'm, I'm an idiot right now, and let me tell you why I'm an idiot right now. And I can't believe I did this. Uh, I was supposed to be at work at 9 o'clock in the morning. It is now 9.10 in the morning, and clearly I'm not at work. I'm still here at my house. See, right back there. Uh, anyway, uh, it turns out when I was getting ready to leave, I left the house. I locked the door like I always do, shut it, came out, and then guess what I realized? I don't have my keys. That's right, I don't have my car keys. So yeah, that's idiot number one. Then I realized, oh crap. And then I'm like, oh, how am I going to do this? And so obviously I can't open the front door because, you know, it's locked. And of course, my car keys are on it, so I can't get in the car. I can't drive. So I'm like, you know what? I know that the door, the back door, is somewhat, you know, a little hard to shut. You know, all that good stuff. So I thought, I'd try the back door, see if I can get in. <laughs> yeah. That ain't opening either. Um, but I figured maybe I would get in there because that door has always not been a good door Sometimes it doesn't shut all the way, you know, there, there's just something with the door frame that's warped a little bit, so. Yeah, so, yeah, no. <laughs> oh, my ride's coming. I'll be back. All right, sorry about that. Um, my coworker came and picked me up. <laughs> but anyways, like I was saying, oh, and forgive the noise outside. You know, there have been people around here doing stuff. But anyways, um, <clears throat> so yeah, I tried to get in. And I couldn't get in, you know, and I was like, how am I going to get to work? Like, you know, I tried to open up all the windows, couldn't do that. Back door wouldn't open. I tried to, you know, shake the, the doorknob and everything to try to get that to open. That didn't work. Um, so, yeah, so I was like, what am I going to do? I locked my keys in the house and I need to get to work. So, but luckily I called my coworker let them know that I was, you know, what happened and everything. And I was actually prepared to walk to work. Yes, I was. I was prepared to, you know, just hoof it. it usually takes me about an hour, hour, 15 minutes or so to walk to work. Um, but, um, but yeah, uh, my coworker said that they would come and pick me up. So, you know, so I'm thankful for that. Um, they didn't have to do that. Um, you know, I mean, I feel bad that, you know, I had to, you know, get them to do that and everything. And I feel like such an idiot for doing for doing that because normally I'm not the one to lock my keys in the house. It's been a long time since I've done something like that. And um, I always kept telling myself, you know, Joey, you should really make yourself an extra key and, you know, and hide it somewhere outside. And, you know... I always said, you know, we need to do that, we need to do that, we need to do that, and then guess what? Never do it. And today, I wish I could, you know, I would have done it because then I would have had a key to get in, to grab my keys, so I get to work, you know, and not feel too much like an idiot like I already do today. Especially since, you know, I ended up being 20 minutes late for work. 
20 minutes. I know that doesn't seem like too, too late, but normally I'm on time all the time. So yeah, I was a little, you know, miffed at myself because, you know, being late, you know, so I guess it is what it is. But I just wanted to tell you guys that, yeah, I really am an idiot. So, and that really happened. So, and, uh, and of course I couldn't, uh, you know, get, um, uh, my wife or my mother to come and bail me out, you know, to, cause they all got keys, but they're not home this weekend. They are away, uh, visiting my aunt and uncle out in Berwick, Pennsylvania. So yeah, a little hard to, you know, get a little help from them three hours away. But anyway, it is what it is, but I'm at work now, so, so yay for that. Um, so I guess when they get home sometime today, they're either going to have to bring the car to me or pick me up when I'm done tonight at midnight. So we'll see. But anyway, um, that's going to about do it for this video. I, it's just a little short video just to tell you how much of an idiot I am, you know, all that good stuff. But, uh, but anyway, um, as always, if you like this video, don't forget to uh, hit that subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up and hit that notification bell so you get notified of future videos. And um, also, um, if you want to support this dumb little channel of mine and you want to continue to hear me make an idiot of myself all the time, uh, uh, yeah, hit the join button, become a member of the Idiot Squad, and, uh, you know, help support the channel, become an idiot, you know, an honorary idiot, all that good stuff. <laughs> Anyway, and, and then, of course, you can also follow me on all the major social medias. The links and all that's all down below. And, of course, the merch store. Check that out in case you see something on there you like, especially since Christmas is going to be coming soon. You, you know what I mean? And uh, also, if you haven't done so yet, uh, you're looking for a podcast to listen to, uh, listen to mine. Idiots Are Us, The Story of Me. Season 1 is available right now on Anchor, Spotify, Google Podcast, Apple Podcast, and Amazon Music. So, if you have not done that, go give that a listen. Um, sometime, I hope to start recording Season 2. Just I haven't gotten around to that yet. But anyways, um, <clears throat> yeah, so yeah, that's going to about do it for this video. It's just me letting you know that I really am an idiot in real life. So, yay, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm an idiot. Uh, anyways, um, so anyway, with that, I hope you're having a good day, good night, good week, good weekend, whatever the case may be. Halloween's coming up here next week, so hope you have a good Halloween and all that happy good stuff. So with that, I will see y'all in the next video, so bye for now. Yeah.